Our current knowledge of the cosmos reveals a captivating tale. 13.8 billion years ago, the universe burst into existence from an unimaginably hot and dense state. In an instant, space expanded, matter cooled, and the fundamental forces of nature began to take shape, setting the stage for the ongoing cosmic drama. This extraordinary event marked the birth of the very elements that form galaxies, stars, planets, and all that has existed or is yet to come, including ourselves. The quest to comprehend the universe's origins not only deepens our scientific understanding, but also confronts profound existential questions about reality and our place within the grand tapestry of the cosmos. While theories and simulations strive to unravel the nature of this primordial genesis, our observations are limited by the relentless expansion of the universe. Hence, Grasping the birth of the first monumental structures that emerged shortly after the Big Bang becomes pivotal in dissipating the fog surrounding our beginnings. This is precisely why the James Webb Space Telescope was meticulously crafted to explore the early universe in the aftermath of the Big Bang. Already, it has unveiled perplexing mysteries that challenge astronomers. The latest revelations from Webb have shattered preconceived notions about the appearance of early galaxies. Astronomers long believed that these infant systems would resemble spherical orbs or flat disks, akin to their modern counterparts. However, the telescope's new images have astounded researchers by revealing something far stranger. These nascent galaxies bear an uncanny resemblance to bananas. Astonishingly, this conclusion comes after a meticulous re-examination of 4,000 newborn galaxies captured by Webb at the dawn of time. Should these findings stand the test of scrutiny, they possess the potential to revolutionize our comprehension of the intricate processes governing the birth and expansion of galaxies. Furthermore, they offer tantalizing clues about the enigmatic properties of dark matter a mysterious and invisible substance that is thought to constitute a significant portion of the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope's revelations not only challenge our preconceptions, but also beckon us to embark on a thrilling journey of discovery where the universe's secrets await those who dare to explore. What adds an intriguing layer to this discovery is the resistance it faces from many astronomers, despite building upon earlier hints from the Hubble telescope, which had also suggested that the earliest galaxies took the shape of pickles. One scientist, Dr. Alan Dressler of the Carnegie Observatories, who played a pivotal role in the development of the James Webb Space Telescope, remains skeptical about these findings, although he was not directly involved in this particular observation. I retain some skepticism about this result, given how hard it is to make such a measurement, especially for galaxies that are far away, small, and not very bright," he expressed. Nonetheless, the team delved into the investigation of galaxies' three-dimensional shapes by statistically analyzing their two-dimensional projections in the sky. If these primordial galaxies were spherical or disk-shaped and positioned randomly in space, astronomers would expect them to occasionally present their complete faces, appearing round and circular when observed through telescopes. However, the observed data deviates from this anticipated pattern. Instead, astronomers are consistently encountering an abundance of shapes resembling cigars and bananas. They consistently look very linear, explained Dr. Panya, the study's lead author, with some galaxies exhibiting multiple bright clumps arranged like pearls on a necklace. These elongated galaxies are a rarity in the present universe, but they make up a remarkable 80% of the galaxies within the Cosmic Evolution Early Release Science Sample, which extends back to approximately 500 million years after the Big Bang. 
The masses of these peculiar galaxies indicate that they could be the ancestors of galaxies like our own Milky Way, suggesting that our galaxy may have undergone a similar phase of elongation or surfboard-like morphology in the past. In the modern universe, galaxies predominantly assume two basic forms, featureless, rounded clouds known as ellipticals and flat, wispy disks like our Milky Way. Evidently, these earliest newborn galaxies did not begin their cosmic journey in such familiar shapes. Back in 1926, Edwin Hubble devised a classification scheme known as the Hubble Sequence that segregated galaxies into three categories – ellipticals, lenticulars and spirals – based on their appearance. Cut to the recent present, and in 2010, a team of European astronomers using data from the Hubble Space Telescope observations created a census of galaxy types and shapes from a time before Earth and the Sun existed, up to the present. The team sampled 116 local galaxies and 148 distant galaxies. The results showed that the Hubble sequence six billion years ago was very different from the one that astronomers see today. Six billion years ago, there were many more peculiar galaxies than now, which was very surprising, and which also meant that in the last six billion years, these peculiar galaxies must have become normal spirals, giving us a more dramatic picture of the recent universe. The astronomers think that these peculiar galaxies became spirals through collisions and mergers. Although it was commonly believed that galaxy mergers decreased significantly 8 billion years ago, the new result implied that mergers were still occurring frequently after that time, up to as recently as 4 billion years ago. This study also reiterated that spiral galaxies are indeed young galaxies that have not been around for a very long term as compared to other types of galaxies. Now cut to the present, and we have the James Webb Space Telescope that is taking our cosmology for a spin. And its latest finding is another blow to our understanding of the universe. The standard model of cosmology suggests that galaxies evolved over time. They formed from vast clouds of primordial hydrogen and helium and so likely had a fairly amorphous structure at the beginning. Given the density of the early universe, galactic collisions and mergers were common, which gave galaxies their rotations and caused them to form disks and spirals. All of this takes time, so we would expect spiral galaxies to be fairly common in the local universe, but rare in the early universe. Now, a team of scientists has used data from the Cosmic Evolution Early Release Science Survey, which was gathered by the James Webb Space Telescope. They identified 873 galaxies greater than 10 billion solar masses with red shifts between 0.5 and 4. Galaxies at this red shift are between 5 billion and 12 billion years old, so they span the range of early galaxies to modern ones. Of these galaxies, 216 were classified as spirals. The researchers were careful to note that some may be merging galaxies that were misclassified. But even then, 108 of the galaxies were unanimously classified as spirals by evaluators. When the team arranged them by redshift, they found that while the fraction of spirals decreased as you went further into the past, the fraction of spirals at redshifts above Z equals to 3 was much higher than expected. A redshift of Z equals to 3 is around 11.5 billion years. When the team calibrated observations, they found about a fifth of galaxies at Z equals to 3 are spiral galaxies. These very early galaxies would have had to become spirals less than 2 billion years after the Big Bang, meaning that there would have been little time for mergers and collisions to be the cause. In other words, many galaxies evolved into disc-shaped spirals quite early in the universe. So while collisions and mergers do play a role in the formation of spiral galaxies, there are likely other factors that come into play. In the quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos, 
the James Webb Space Telescope has emerged as an unprecedented tool, defying expectations and challenging our understanding of the early universe. Its groundbreaking findings have captured the imagination of astronomers and sparked a cosmic curiosity that knows no bounds. Share your thoughts by leaving a comment, and for more information to satisfy your cosmic curiosity, subscribe to Cosmos Prodigy, where the universe unfolds.